ask, um, I'm going to go back to the solar initiative again. <laughs> and just kind of, I, I don't know if, if I missed that you said this, Alan. Should we still have outstanding proposals out there for the large scale utility? Mm -hmm. So that's still out, and that won't be identified until November, December, beginning of next year. Right. So um, there's still an opportunity for significant um, development of that initiative. Right. So, yeah. Absolutely. Um, a couple of things that I want to touch base on. I'll touch base on the Great Promise Partnership before we go into some other stuff. And that, um, you know, this Not Us to City Schools is really um, taking on this project. And they've been, um, they're excited about the opportunity. Um, our role in this is helping, and Megan, that Megan's um, working with Lori on, is just making sure we make those introdu introductions to the existing industries for them to allow the program to happen. So um, I would, Kind of highlight on that um, and then just to kind of talk about develop business development opportunities and what's really going on in our community um, i recently spoke with a um, reporter for georgia trend to give an update on our area and what i would say is that we've seen a lot of great activity from our existing industries and there's a lot of potential out there and what we're seeing from them is um, they're expanding, one, because they've gotten to a point where their business is such that they've got to expand. Um, and they're in that critical point where financing needs to come together, so that's exciting. And so a lot of new jobs out there to be created by our existing industries. But then if you look at the projects that we have in the project report, that's all new projects. That's a lot of significant activity that's taking place here in Valdosta, which is not taking place in a lot of the other areas in our region. So, you know do you know that but in regards to that we're not just going to sit here and wait for projects to hopefully land in our lap we're trying to be aggressive with that so um, I attended Pack Expo in Vegas um, which is a packaging expo for the food and beverage industry so for our existing food and beverage industries that we do have for South Georgia for time, which they may have some opportunities and for others we identified possible suppliers for them for them to locate here so hopefully we can build those, continue on building those relationships. Um, Megan is going to be attending Process Expo, which only happens every two years in Chicago. And she'll be attending that um, end of, beginning of November with um, the Department of Economic Development and their food logistics team. So she and several other people will be on that trip as well. So that's exciting. We'll also be attending our yearly trip to SEMA that we do with STEDA. So that's coming up in November as well. So there'll be a lot of people out of the office in the first week of November. Um, so call Lou if you need anything. And then, um, so we'll be doing that in partnership with STEDA um, um, to go to SEMA and identify possible suppliers for them and new companies to come into the automotive area. Um, and in addition to that, while we're working with our direct companies and building those relationships, we'll also be developing um, site consultant relationships. One being with, um, in December, there is a site consultant forum that we'll go to in Charleston, South Carolina to meet with over 50 site consultants um, and network with them. We're actually a sponsor for that event, so that gives us additional time with them. Um, and then we'll also be doing a marketing event to visit site consultants in Chicago. And some of those site consultants actually have brought us um, one of these projects that you'll see on the list and we'll be visiting with them. And that'll be taking place um, right after the site consultant event in December. And in addition to that, I have been asked to, as a representative for our area, about Austin Lowndes County, to do prospect visits um, in an international trade um, event. So, um, be going, I'll be going to Paris and I'll visit SAFT and their headquarters as well as some of their suppliers and talk to them potentially about doing business here and also with the Department of Economic Development do other business um, meetings and then other businesses in other parts of France as well. So um, that's a great opportunity for us to get up and talk about the southern part of the state here and what we can offer. So those are just some of the business development opportunities that we have coming up as well as our existing industries. Um, I will then talk about our audit. So Mr. Tom Davis, I mean, would help me here. 